Hi, Professor Wenaina here. Your five minutes teacher on education, childhood, youth, parenting, and all things school. Welcome. One of the topics uh, that is taking time to meaningfully enter our educational conversations is AI. If AI can learn faster, communicate better, and perform tasks for which we go to school, and do so with superhuman precision, then what role remains for human learning? What, indeed, should we be teaching our children in the world of AI, and perhaps more urgently, why and how should we teach it? The ground is shifting beneath our feet. The old answers, training children for stable careers, preparing them for examinations and instilling rote knowledge, feel obsolete when machines outperform humans at every one of these skills. Yet, schools are clinging to these outdated practices, delivering curricula designed for a pre-digital era. Those of us who recognize this mismatch often find ourselves constrained by entrenched systems that resist change. But here's the truth. This resistance is no longer merely inconvenient. It is reckless. And don't Talk to me about the nonsense and suckers called CBC or CBE or whatever they want to call it. Have you seen their basic education curriculum framework? It is 158 pages and not once, not even once, have they mentioned the word artificial intelligence. This means we are persisting with traditional teaching methods and, and we risk educating students for irrelevance. When AI can generate essays, analyze data, and write code, teaching these skills becomes futile. We need to concentrate on the uniquely human capabilities machines cannot replicate. Yet, yet, because they soon will. A student who can interrogate an AI's conclusions, understand its biases, and wield it responsibly still has a chance. A student who cannot is doomed, and most of ours are in the doomed category. A radical reframing of what we teach is urgent. Content should no longer be king. Context must take its place. The ability to ask the right questions, synthesize disparate ideas, and adapt to complex and familiar situations outweighs the memorization of facts that our children are being taught. Research from the World Economic Forum underscores this shift, identifying skills like analytical thinking, innovation, and resilience as vital in the age of automation. What's more, UNESCO's uh, Education 2030 agenda highlights the importance of acquiring global citizenship, uh, emphasizing interconnectedness and sustainability over isolated, uh, isolated knowledge. But even more important than what we teach is the question of why do we teach? Education should inspire learners to wield AI for the collective good, not just personal gain. This requires a moral and ethical compass that schools over centuries have been hopelessly unable to instill. As AI grows more capable, the why behind our teaching becomes an even more urgent question. Having clarified the what and the why, we arrive at the practical question of how. Lecture-based instruction and standardized testing, relics of the assembly line model, are spectacularly ill-suited to this moment. Instead, education should embrace methodologies that mirror the real world, dynamic, collaborative, and iterative. 
project based learning uh, interdisciplinary inquiry and uh, problem solving approaches should immerse students in the kind of complex challenges they will face uh, outside the classroom also ai itself must be integrated not as a competitor but as a partner in learning tools like adaptive learning platforms natural language processing tutors and ai driven research assistants sh should personalize education allowing students to explore at their own pace and focus on their on their own interests your role as a citizen is not to passively observe this revolution it is to question everything why does this curriculum exist what does this method achieve how does this policy serve my child in the age of ai if the answers feel unsatisfactory and they predictably will you must insist on better ones the stakes are high very very high for complacency we are no longer merely teaching children to keep pace with the world in a world transformed by ai our collective future depends on how boldly we reimagine education this is not a moment for tweaks and uh, cbc nonsense it is a moment to start over because if we don't the machines won't outpace us they will replace us thank you for your time see you in the next lesson